away or crack away. Let's, let's see what's cool. going on. So, because I see it a lot in your back garden, I guess, which is getting sort of more like a range as it, as it goes, <laughs> yeah. as time goes on. Um, what's the best thing you think for how people, how should people train at home during the winter or during lockdown? What's the best thing they can be doing? Well, if they've got an outside space, obviously, um, and the ability to hit a golf ball, now it doesn't have to be a proper golf ball. That can be a softened golf ball, you know, like the plastic, the air yeah. blows, the rubber type golf balls. I would be running, because you can't really do strike, because some people, even though they've got a net, they're worried about it rebounding, they're worried about missing the net, you know, so many things going on. I would say the biggest thing you can do is work on sequence. And, um, in certainly slow motion golf swings and it's the time to do it so if you're going to make a big change this is the time to do it or get in front of the net and hit a bunch of shots with a change of grip you know so if you're going to change stuff like grip or shot shape or trying to change that one aspect in your game that you've always hated to change because every time you try to implement the change you hated the ball flight we all know how difficult it is to make a technical change but sometimes you have to remove sounds silly you know this as well as i do you sometimes just remove the ball flight for like a month you say look forget the ball flight just get the technical ideas down and then we can facilitate a ball flight or release pattern change or you know something to adopt the ball flight that you want if you're you know for example i had an online lesson today with a friend of mine who have had a few lessons with now he's always typically slid against sort of left side big slide because he's a huge tilt of his sort of pelvis so he's now going to spend a month now trying to get it the other way um but he's going to hit some terrible shots because as he slides he then releases this way he opens his body out he might hit it hard left for a while but i think if you're at home and you've got five minutes a good way to practice is in front of a say the window outside in front of your door frame slow motion stuff in front of it in a net send it to your, your pro and say look i'm working on some slow motion how does the sequence work and i would i would do that really And then if you've got five minutes or if you've got 10 minutes, I would get, this is what I've tried to get my clients to do. This is a, one I think maybe many, many people would like. Go on Google Maps, get your golf club up and start mapping your own golf club. And going, right, where does my, because most people have got access to how do they do. They can see what holes they hate. They can think about what hole is causing them the most problems. Have a little look on Google Maps because you can zoom on in and see, right, well, that bunk is at 250. Why do I keep it in three wood at it? Or why do I keep it in dry wood at it? If I just hit three iron at it, maybe build a bit of a plan for the next time you go out on the golf course. So if it's not technical, I would say go and spend half an hour on the golf on the computer and build a you can even build your own sort of map. You can build yourself a little Google map, print off 18 sheets, and start and think about how you're going to play the golf course properly next time around rather than just turn up and we're all excited to play but that might just help yeah, we'll see but a lot of people again like when i started coaching there wasn't a platform for it but nobody shared anything it was so insular and just uh shocking i mean, i think it's um i think the more people share the better i literally yeah. don't I, don't I don't see anyone benefiting from anywhere if people hold either what works technique wise or yeah. how they're growing their business i think there's far too many golfers out there that we could all do pretty good Thank you.